Kilifi County Governor Aspirant Aisha Jumwa has blamed President Uhuru Kenyatta and Azimio leader Rilo Odinga over the risen cost of maize flour in the country. Aisha said that the high cost of the commodity wouldn't have risen if the two leaders did not unite in the handshake government. She took issue with the president for having tasked Odinga as his advisor instead of his deputy president William Ruto. According to the Malindi Member of Parliament, the Kenyan economy including the cost of Ungo was favorable when Ruto and Uhuru were together before the handshake. She warned Kenyans not to elect leaders who will worsen the country's high cost of living while campaigning for Ruto to be best fit presidential candidate. Aisha also faulted Governor Kingi for not changing Kilifi fortunes in the past 10 years. She warned Kilifi residents not to make the same mistake of electing a leader who does not have the best interest of the residents in their agenda. <laughs> While campaigning for the Kenya Kwanzaa Alliance team Kilifi North MP Owen Baya criticized leaders who went to court to challenge Aisha Jumwa's degree to bar her from contesting for Kilifi gubernatorial seat. He defended Jumwa saying that even though she didn't attain the degree qualification at her Form 4 level, it does not imply that she did not go ahead to pursue a degree course in the next levels. In between the years, there is nothing. Uyu Aisha is a good example of a Michigan woman who has struggled through the ranks. Taka mefika pale ju. Leo watu wanataka kuzima hii ndoto. Hii ndoto ya Aisha siyo yake peke yake. It is a communal dream for the whole community. Kwa masisi tunaeta toa mama pale chini, tumweke pale ju. Rio sababu mimi ya wenbaya na familia ya kuna watu wangu. Tunasema tutapatia huyu Aisha Jumwa kura ya ugavana. Siyo ugavana peke yake, lakini tunaeka a good example at the top. Swali la kwanza Aisha Jumwa na kuombea ama utaingia na jua si mama wa kulala. Bahari yetu hii imeenda. Mnajua kila kitu kinachofanyika baharini. Nataka tujaribu tuangalie mali zetu ndio nimesimama independent kwa sababu nikiingia 
nataka nisonge na wananchi sina story ya kuita baba wala ya kumuita mama mimi peke yangu na wananchi ile pesa nitaipata nina imani nitasaidia wananchi na nikiingia zile milioni kumi habari ya wazazi aende kwa chifu aende sijui kwa pasta aende sijui akasainiwe kwa principal sijui nani hiyo itaizika kwenye kaburi la sahau tutaeka kwa mtandao watoto wenu wote nitawaweka kibarani wodi nimefanya research watoto wa form 1 to form 4 wako watoto 400 na 400 na 200 watoto 400 na 200 kwa milioni kumi wanaweza kusoma bila mtoto kurejeshwa hata kidogo na niko na imani wazazi kwa imani na waomba kura zenu na nitakapoingia ili nijembe na nitatoboa